What's going on, guys? I hope everyone's doing well. I don't know what to do with myself. We have Tropical Storm Ophelia coming in from the south. Just started raining a couple hours ago. It's gonna be raining for the next three days. I have a bunch of tickets to the King of the Baggers race that is going to be here, which is here already, in Millville, New Jersey at New Jersey Motorsport Park. We're supposed to be going there Sunday. I don't know if that's gonna happen now, so I'm kind of bummed out because it is supposed to be like torrential rains, wind, uh, flooding, and all that good stuff that comes with a tropical storm. So I don't know where we're gonna go. They might, I don't know, I know they run in the rain, but I don't know if it gets pretty bad. They might maybe, maybe push it forward until Monday or Tuesday, not sure. Not sure what's gonna happen. So we'll see, we'll keep our fingers crossed. You guys are always asking me what helmet I'm using on Mad Max. And this is the Rurock Atlas 4.0 liquid carbon helmet. I got the chrome visor, love the visibility out of the helmet, the Moto Vlog, super crystal clear audio. Uh, you also have the Shockwave Bluetooth system right there, super, super clean audio. You could make and uh, receive phone calls. I mean, the helmet has it all, it's light. Really like it, did some really long trips uh, with the helmet and I just, I really do love it. I don't, I don't have, I've, I haven't had a problem with it, especially the Atlas 4.0. It's, it's a, it's a really good helmet, especially on the inside where I believe the previous models, a lot of people are complaining about the cushioning inside the helmet, but they changed all that. It's like really robust now, really super comfy helmet. So I have no issues. I'm also actually using the Rurock Atlas 4.0 track edition with my Hayabusa. So love the helmet, but as the title shows, I did get something pretty cool. You guys may say, well, what the hell does Star Wars have to do with helmets or motorcycles or Harley Davidsons or whatever? I'm gonna show you guys. Rurox just sent me out something and before we get into that, I'm, I'm a huge Star Wars fan. I've, I've been for a long time. It's Star Wars been around a long time. And if you're about my age, around 50 years old, you know, you remember back in the day, I think what, Star Wars came out early 1970s, if I'm not mistaken. So, you know, we all grew up with Star Wars, right? So they sent me out something really cool I wanna show you guys. And at the end of the video, I'm gonna tell you guys how you could possibly get one. So let me take it out of the box and show you because um, I'm not gonna be using that helmet on Mad Max anymore. I'm gonna be using something really wicked. All right, so I'm gonna do a little, I already opened it, but I put it back in the box, but I wanna show you guys. So what we have here, this is pretty cool, I'm telling you. <laughs> And they have a couple, actually a couple styles uh, to choose from, which I'll go over in a bit. But you ready for this? This is the Star Wars Darth Vader helmet. Look at this thing. You know why I love it so much? Because it matches Mad Max. I am waiting on the chrome visor still for it because I think it's gonna look absolutely insane but look it's got like a little bit of white and chrome like this right here is the death star i don't know if you guys could see that and look at the front it's like not too much but it's just enough to look badass and cool and give you that star wars kind of visual on the helmet and so now they have a bobo fett helmet and they also have a stormtrooper helmet which looked pretty badass, but if I had a white bike, I would have got the Stormtrooper helmet because it's like white and black, it looks really sick. The Bobo Fett is kind of that like green color, wouldn't go good. If I had maybe a green bike, then definitely. But this helmet, when I seen it, I said, oh my God, they sent me out one. I said, you guys gotta send me one of these out, and they did. And let me tell you, this thing looks absolutely insane it looks so cool wicked like i said it's got the death star on it what do you guys think but right here also that's where the shockwave bluetooth system goes in which is 
right here. So this is powered by Harman Kardon. And let me tell you, a lot of people ask me also the question, how does the Bluetooth uh, sound system sound in the helmet? It's, it's amazing. It's really crystal clear. As you can see there, powered by Harman Kardon. It's crisp, it's loud, it has bass, it just sounds really good. Also, the setup has a microphone attached to that setup where you could make and receive phone calls with the Bluetooth system. So like you could, you could make, you could take a phone call, which is important because if I'm on the bike, if there's an important phone call, how many times you have to either pull over to answer the phone call if it's someone from your family, something important, with this system, you don't have to. And the music, it just, even with my loud exhaust, I'm telling you, it sounds fantastic. So check this thing out, huh? Let me know down below in the comments what you guys think. Um, you could also check out their website to see all of the other helmets. They have, they have a whole bunch of helmets. Like I said, that one's the liquid carbon, which I really love as well. I get a lot of compliments on that helmet, but I'm gonna be rocking, I'm gonna be rocking this one with Mad Max. I just, I think it fits well. If I knew I was gonna get this helmet, I would've probably, like before I got Mad Max, I would've probably named it Vader or Darth or something like that. But uh, either way, I think it's gonna look good. I think all the black and chrome on Mad Max, look at that, is just going to look insane with this helmet. I think it's gonna look great. But we'll have to get some some footage, some shots of me riding with the helmet, but I, I think it's gonna look badass. But anyway, this is what I wanted to tell you guys. I'm doing another giveaway. It's gonna end October 31st. All you gotta do is go to my website, www.cycle-fanatics.com, buy one sticker or two or four or five. Each sticker is going to get you one entry into the giveaway. I'm going to be announcing somebody October 31st. And this is what we have for the giveaway. We have one Atlas 4.0 carbon helmet of your choice with the Rurox Shockwave Harman Kardon setup. We also have a Beyond Riders full Kevlar line flannel and they have many colors to choose from. And First Manufacturing just came on board. They're going to also be giving us one leather twill vest. So that's all going to be part of the giveaway. So that's awesome. It's kind of pretty much, this giveaway, it's kind of setting up to be like a riding gear giveaway. So you guys are ready to rock for the fall and winter months while you're riding on your bikes. You're gonna have some of the best gear out there. So again, go to www.cycle-fanatics.com, get yourself some stickers, get entered to win October 31st. I'm gonna be announcing that lucky person. All right, guys, that's it for this video. Just a short video, just wanted to come on and say hello, what's up? Hope everybody is doing well, safe. Hope your families are doing well. And after this rain is all gone, we're gonna be getting out. I just love riding in these cooler, chillier fall weeks. We're gonna get out there and get some nice, awesome ride videos for you guys. We have a lot of awesome things that are gonna be happening here in the next couple weeks, so stay tuned. And until the next one, peace out. Come on, tell me how badass that is gonna look, huh? On Mad Max. Hell yeah. Kid at heart, baby, kid at heart. Oh, that just matches absolutely perfectly.